It is quarter till nine. Cool news to deliver to you. Two of central Indiana's oldest and best examples of holiday giving are teaming up. Wish Tree and Toys for Tots. Toys for Tots launches today here in central Indiana. Later in the year as the exclusive media partner for this year's Toys for Tots. We are hosting a drive then to benefit the effort. A couple of new friends to be with us here today. Sabrina Young from Toys for Tots and Gunnery Sergeant Alexander Bay, who knows this effort. Well, thank you both for being with us. Thank this you. is this having us. our best news of the day to deliver, clearly. Toys in hand already. <laughs> uh, Sabrina, the boxes go out starting today. How's that work? Yeah. These are our iconic boxes uh, that the, the Marine Corps puts out for Toys for Tots. And you see we have a new sponsor in the Channel 8 <laughs> is our nice. ex exclusive sponsor this year. We're very excited to have you guys. Uh, but as of today, you can go on our website and request uh, the boxes to be in your store. And there's two locations you can pick them up, one being at Fort Harrison and one being in Plainfield. But you'll find all those uh, directions to the boxes on the website. And you can collect toys all the way up to the December 17th. I think that's one of the neat things that you're able to do that some of the others can't. This is not just for partners or sponsors. Anybody who wants to help can help, correct? Yes. And, you know, our biggest supporters are the public. I mean, we, we obviously have great sponsors, and we have two new this year, uh, Bank of Indianapolis and PG uh, Superstore. The PGA Superstore, yeah, PGA exactly. Superstore, yeah. really thrilled about them. But everybody for Toys for Tots is very important. Every individual who puts a toy in the box, <laughs> in the store, is a supporter of Toys for Tots, and anybody who sends us money is obviously a supporter. Uh, Gunnery Sergeant, you've been involved in this effort in the past. Have you been able to get a sense of the gratitude that people have on the delivery end of this when, when all these great things that people gather and bring and drop off are, are actually then sent out to the kids who need them? Definitely. When, when we talk to the uh, not-for-profits that will come in, you know, they, they let us know, and, and they, they, just, they are so appreciative of everything that uh, the community supports for Toys for Tots. And when the toys go out, it's, it's very important. It's, it's just so important for the children. Are, are there specific things that you need or want when people give? What kinds of things should they be giving? Well, we really have a deficit every year in ages zero to two. Okay. Uh, baby things right. um, and that's just as simple as rattles and little baby toys and then older children which for us is 10 to 14 mm -hmm. uh, we go to age 14 and I think that's because people think it's expensive or maybe they want video games and so we still do basketballs and footballs sure. and we do shower gel we do nail polish we do makeup so uh, we've branched out and, and we do a lot of things that the kids nowadays really like. Any specifics? You want things wrapped, unwrapped? Um, like, you know, unwrapped mm -hmm. um, is, the, is the best because we sort through and we see what it is and we give it to the, the certain age groups. So we really need it to be unwrapped. Box says it unwrapped toys only October 1st. The date's right there through <laughs> December. Thank you both for being with us. We'll check in often with you, and then as we get closer to our drive that we're going to team up and help you with as well, we'll have lots more to talk about that too. But Toys for Tots is underway. David James, you're giving them a great kickoff day for it. Yeah.